Aloha my Kako and welcome to another episode of Stay at Home Blues and Oranges brought to you by After School All Stars Hawaii. My name is Miss Ile and I am the site coordinator over at Mount Kuli High and Intermediate School. If you are new here, please don't forget to like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Also follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and TikTok and turn on notifications so that you can keep up with all of our new content. If you have been keeping up with us, you should know that we have already done two hula classics. One was with myself when we learned with Nani Ko'olo, and the second one was with Auntie T from Big Island when she went over some basic hula steps. In today's episode, we will be learning a song called Oiviye, written by Kumbu John Ke'olo Maka'ainana Maki. Some of the things we will be needing today, just like the last video, is of course the lyrics. The lyrics can be found on Mana Mele website or on huapala.org. So if you can screenshot those and get those ready because we will be going over the lyrics before we learn the moves. And we will be understanding the song before we start dancing the song. Quick disclaimer before we get started, I am not a kumuhula. Once again, I ex as I explained in my last video, um, I do pull things off of YouTube and I make them my own. OEVA was a song that I had learned as a little girl growing up and I fell in love with not just my own culture, but I had a much bigger appreciation for the many different cultures that Hawaii has to offer. Um, I am not of Maori heritage, but I do appreciate the culture. Okay, Awayata Aringa is an action song. In an action song, they use Maori cultures, use it as a way to illustrate the idea behind the song using their hands, bodies, and feet. So very similar to hula. Hula, you tell a story using your hands, bodies, and feet. The second thing we're gonna learn is hand movements. In Maori culture, they like to call it a mahi aringa. Mahi aringa combined with movements of the feet is a warm-up in the song. So, mahi aringa, your hand, make sure your hand is stiff, and all you're gonna do is you're gonna vibrate your hand this way, okay? That's all you're gonna do. I shouldn't see these, I shouldn't see spirit fingers, unless um, you're trying to be in cheerleading, but this is not cheerleading. Um, so, mahi aringa is hand movements, a hand combination, okay? All we're gonna do throughout this whole song is mahi aringa, and you're gonna vibrate your hand this way. That's it. Not big kind, not like this, okay? Just mahi aringa. Okay, so let's get started on the first verse. Again, the song is entitled OEVA. I have my lyrics here on Huapala, which you can also pull up on Manamele. All right, so the first verse reads, Oivie, Oivie e kahea ana ivie. Ua ike mai nei, ua ike mai nei ku onehano. Which translates to natives. Natives of bones or ancestors are calling. I know, I know my homeland. So how the whole song is set up is there is always a kahea and a pane. Kahea is normally done by a leader. The leader will call out the first line of the verse, which is OEVA, and a pane will come from everybody else singing the song, which is OEVA. So in the first motions, all you're gonna do is hehi to the beat of the song. You're gonna step with your right foot to the beat of the song. And then once you kahea and you respond OEVA, your hands are gonna come up and it's only gonna mahi aringa. You're gonna vibrate your hands and stay right here. That's it. The second line says, e kahea ana ivie. So all you're gonna do after from here, you're still stepping throughout the whole song. You're still gonna hehi, mahi aringa, come down on your hip. Your other hand is gonna come by your mouth, still vibrate and call out. Just like that. And then the next line is, ua ike mai nei. Um, your kahea is gonna go first. So you're still gonna stay here, ua ike mai nei. And then when everybody else pane, you're gonna lift up your hands and you're gonna come by your eye and you're gonna look out and switch this way. Okay, okay, and then this last part while you still have heat, um, the lyrics should say ku'u one hano e. So as you're still looking out here, right? Waike my ne, waike my ne. You're gonna still have heat. Your hands are gonna come down, you're gonna swirl up, flip your hands, and clap. 
and then you're gonna make like a land motion at the bottom so this is where you're your, um you are from you're from the land okay so again okay i'm gonna play the song and then this is how it should look like and feel like while the song is playing Verse one down. So now we're gonna move on to the second verse. If you pull out your lyrics, here's what it says: Eya maila, eya maila na kupa aina Behold, behold the natives of Hawaii. Support, support, and be loyal, faithful. So as we left off from the first verse, it is So we're gonna wait for the kahea, which is eya maila. Eya maila. Okay, and then your pane is going to be same. You're still going to hehi. Your arms are going to come up above your chest or right at your chest. Vibrate still your hands. Step and you're going to pane. Okay, so your hands are actually going to stay here all the way up until you reach kako. Okay, so again, it's kuu one After this one, you're gonna bring your hands down and just like in the first verse, you're still gonna hehi. Now flip your hands up once and okay. And then your arm is gonna stick out, your right arm's gonna come out. This arm can stay still, your left arm's gonna come up and vibrate, and gonna up and down, you're gonna up and down your arm like this. So hehi, up and down. Okay? okay. So the second verse all together after we leave, we're gonna start it off. Three, one, two. Okay, so I'm gonna play the song and we're gonna do the first and the second verse and then we'll see how that goes. And it translates to Look to the distant future, look to the distant future, O descendants. The multitudes of friends, humanity stands firm. Humanity stands firm and proud. Humanity stands. Humanity stands firm and proud. So we still left off here, your hehi, and you still come down here, lokahi. And then uh, you're gonna wait for a kahea. As soon as you hear the kahea, um, you pane, and as you pane, you're gonna hehi to your right. Arms gonna come up this way, strong tower and strong foundation here. And you're gonna still gonna mahi oringa, and you're gonna turn this way to your right, and then hehi to your left. Okay? So it should look and sound like this. Okay, 
Okay, the next line is Nakini Maka Maka A. So from here, you're gonna bring your hands down in a fist and you're gonna hegi, you're gonna step with your right foot out in front of you, out in front here, and then both hands are gonna come up as your foot comes back, and you're gonna make two fists and stay right in front of your chest. So Nakini Maka Maka A should look like this. One, two, three, so the last line is Kupa'ake Kanaka, or the next line is Kupa'ake Kanaka. And all we're gonna do, we're just still gonna step, and then we're gonna bring our hands up, flip, and clap. Same thing like how we did in the previous verses, okay? Kupa'ake Kanaka, up, flip, and clap. In that same uh, line is Hano Hano Pa'aheo E. So after we clap from our hands here, we're gonna still hehi, our hands are going to come out, mahiaringa, come in, and lightly tap our chest because we're, we're proud, right? So again, go through that um, last verse, and then you need to remember to listen for the kahia. After the kahia is your time to shine, okay? So let's try. We're leaving off from gokahi, right? Here. Then they call him Kiki Lo and Nai, Kiki Lo and Nai, and I'm on my way. Nakini Maka Maka E, E Kupa A Kekanaka, Kupa A Kekanaka, Kano Hano Haka E, Kekanaka, Kupa A Kekanaka, Hano Hano Haka E. So we learned all verses. Um, good job, everybody. Now we're gonna play the music and we're gonna follow along. So how it goes is the song repeats itself twice, okay? So just listen and follow and then we'll, we'll get it. If you ever have to pause the video and learn another, um, another part of the song, please, please feel free to do so, okay? But other than that, let's play this whole song and see how we do. <laughs> culture besides Hawaiian today. Uh, we did a different rendition of Kula from another culture. If you can comment below, let me know what that was. That would be great. Um, again, make sure you stretch drink water if you need to. And then I will see you folks for the next episode. Comment and let me know what song you want to see next. Um, have a great day, everybody.
Mahalo.